Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, welcome in. I'm the Bronze Jane, and today we're continuing our playthrough of Silent Hill Homecoming. So, we've figured out what to do in the house to get the gasoline. We put it back, drained the basement, went to the backyard, and now I don't know what to do. We listened to the cassette tape, so uh, I just came back here to, to save. So let's try to figure out what to do. I think I'm going to just do a little bit of exploring. Actually, let's go see if... The judge herself is still here. Uh, I think she's in this one. Also, by the way, y'all, I tried so hard to get 60 FPS working on this. I mean, I troubleshooted for at least an hour or two trying to get it to work. Different patches and different solutions. And I just couldn't get it to work. So I'm sorry. It's it's going to be in 30 FPS. Um, I might fiddle with it a Alex, little bit more. please, not now. I have a lot of work to do. Ooh. I'm sorry, girly. Oh, you can't you can't engage her again. Alright, let's leave her alone. She's got a lot of work to do. I know that feeling though. <laughs> Been there. Felt like a little bit of shade though. Alright, let's let's go figure out what to do. Oi! I forgot about this sucker. Uh let's kill it. Let's kill it. Do it! All right, y'all were telling me the knife is OP. I think you're right. I can't let y'all hear the song. It's copyright protected, so uh, let's just get where we need to go. <laughs> it's the banner for the 150th anniversary parade. Shepherd's Glen 150th anniversary celebration. Saturday and Sunday, September 20th and 21st. Two big days, rain or shine. Events kick off Saturday with a parade down Main Street. 10 a.m. Food, games, rides, dunk sink. Featuring Mayor Bartlett. Period costume contest. Prizes will be awarded. Live music and entertainment by Eye of the Storm. Interesting name. Okay, so that's what he was talking about in the last episode to Dr. Holloway. Or <laughs> Judge Holloway. We're at Dr. Fitch's office right now, and that's why I was getting that mixed up. Ooh. What's up? Coming at me? He's gonna, he's gonna do it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright. So, let's see. Maybe there's some hidden items on, like, the edges. If we've learned anything from Silent Hill 1, that, that is something they like to do. Hide things. Especially items that will progress you. Let's make sure to check the backyard. One more time, check the doghouse, because, you know, they like to put keys there. Y'all know what I'm saying? So maybe we'll find something back there that I overlooked. On top of that, um, I believe someone had said that I missed something out there. So let's, let's go out there and see. Aha! Elk drink! Ah. What about this tree? I remember the day we built this treehouse. We had so many good times. Oh yeah! I missed that. Jesus. I wish- we, maybe we can go up in there later. <gasps> it's open! Y'all didn't tell me. <laughs> Just kidding. Now, I appreciate it when people don't tell me sometimes because it's nice that I can uh, figure it out by myself. So, yeah, there was a purse there, but I guess, or a bag. It was Josh's bag. We just needed to click it again. Okay. <gasps> Perfect. And it's looking nice and spooky. Is that blood? Whoa. That's a trip. What the hell happened to the streets? I don't know, but we are somewhere out there. In the Silent Hill Nether. No trespassing. Shepherd's Glen Sewer Services. <gasps> Sewers. Oh god. I hear it. 
<laughs> the door. <laughs> Valves are rusted shut. The physics of the door is pretty neat. It's locked. There's a light coming from the other side. Let's get a look at this place. I see something there. Oh, it's a cemetery. Hey! No peritos. This is where the bereaved would sit. Rose Heights Cemetery Map. Rose Heights. Rose Heights. That makes me think of... Was there a Rose Park or something like that in Silent Hill? I know we're in Shepherd's Glen right now, so I'm not sure if they tie, if they are the same thing or what. We'll, we'll, I'll find out. But this seems familiar, that name. We're in the old crypts. There's going to be the East Garden. Look at all these crypts. South, mid, and north. Oh my god, this makes me think about the freaking train station in Silent Hill 4. Oh my god. Founders Row. It doesn't make me think of the train station in Silent Hill 3. That was like a whole other animal. Founders Garden. Bartlett Mal Malazium. Parking lot front entrance. West Garden. Alright, we've got a lot of exploring to do, folks. Are y'all ready for this? Listen to the sounds. Not just the barking. Like that. Like a wind. Passing through passageways. Hollow passageway. Oliver Hall died November 6, 1875. Erica Hall. Whoa. Hello? That was kind of scary. It's really spooky. I can barely see. It's hard to see in all of this fog. Colin B. 32. Hey, that's how old I am. Bruce Norwood. Nobody laughs, nobody cries. Where he goes, how he fares, nobody knows, nobody cares. Hmm. Poetry. So many nameless tombs. What happened to all these people? <laughs> well, they died. So many people dead. These tombs don't even have names on them. Why didn't they put names on these tombs? Roxy and Rigby. Love is eternal and can never be leashed. We won't be able to ask you anything now. Head Devonport. I love being able to read all this. Oh, a person! What's that guy doing? What's that guy doing? <laughs> Why is that guy digging up graves? He's probably trying to make some money or something. Or he works here, maybe. Whoa. Oh, you can climb down. Oh, I see, I see. This is where we came from. Oh, I see. Okay, we're going to the East Garden. Let's go. Buckle up, everybody. Oh, yeah. Alex. He's our man. If he can't do it, nobody can. Something's lurking. Doggos! Bring it on. Oh, they look so creepy. Come here! I'm not messing. Yeah, that's right. Take that. Yeah, and that. You got a friend? Who else? I know you got friends. Don't play with me. A grave there. Or a... Um, it's like... It's like... Yeah, like dilapidated. This whole freaking area caved in. Oh! 
This fountain is hereby dedicated to the memory of Charlotte Borden by her loving parents, taken suddenly from life yet fulfilled. Born. The rest is illegible. Eight years old? Aww. Inseparable yet divided. Two halves of the same person in two places, now forever apart. <gasps> oh, that's cool. I like that. I like that. Tying that in. I see. So, looks like we're going to need the other piece, but sorry I'm flipping the camera around so much. I just am trying to find a way out of here. Yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, hold on, let me go back because it was shining. It did look like we might need something. I was assuming we would complete the puzzle right here. So, um, that's why I wasn't sure if I took it or not, but, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Doesn't seem like we'll return here. Oh, we can climb up. <clears throat> oh, look at you go! Look at Alex go. More children's graves. So many people have died here. Y'all, I hear a soundtrack playing in the background. I have no idea if it's called- uh, it probably is from the OSC. If it is, this is gonna be so choppy until it stops. Or I might mute it. I don't know. We'll- we'll figure it out. This gate is padlocked and overgrown with vines. Alright, let's go into the Malazium. Is that how you say it? Ma Malus Malazium? The gate to the Bartlett family mausoleum is locked. And that's where the guy's digging. Okay. Key point right here. Boom. So, uh, we, we might go through all the crypts then and somehow, yeah, make it down the Founder's Row into the garden, maybe. Perhaps. Mayhaps. That's a cool little gazebo. Alright, crypt time, baby! Padlocked. Oh, sheesh. Excuse me. I'm a girl. Oh my god. <laughs> Hey! Oh, I'm gonna remember you. Uh, actually, <laughs> let's try to get over there. We we'll probably have to go to the next crypt over. Padlocked. Anything in these corners? I'm checking for items this time. I don't want to miss nothing. Okay. Let's stagger our saves. Oh, missing persons. Is this like the name of the chapter? I think so, because we are looking for our family. I don't recognize this name. Let's check our map for that. Oh, cool! Thank you for marking it for me. Oh, I know this song is copyright. Oh, looks like we have a passageway open here. Squeeze through. Drink! Ah. Oh, it's padlock. What? Alright, so this is just a dead end. So we need to go back then. Where we squeeze through. Find something out this way. Yeah, yeah, look at this, look at this! Hack! What's the weapon we need? We need an axe. Where? Are we... Have we missed it? Have we missed it? No, dude. No. I searched the entire town. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I went here, 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 and you can't get through these. These are not- you can't access those. Those are just walls. I went through the park too. Nothing. There ain't no way. It's here somewhere. It's here somewhere. We just might have missed it. Alright, well I doubled back and I realized I didn't have my freaking flashlight the whole time. Just, I don't know why. Uh, so maybe we'll be able to see things a little bit better. And maybe I will find whatever it is I need to break those boards down. That is my hope. Now that I can freaking see what I'm doing. There must be something in a nook. Oh, here it is. Just a little freaking area. I just didn't have my flashlight on. Alright. I got it now. I'm back on the on the truck. That's gonna be locked. 
names are entirely worn away. Okay. Rhonda Hunt, daughter of Cat Nathan, Miss Lydia Hunt, died September 23rd, 1864. Lemuel Jacobs. <laughs> bong bong. Lydia. Lydia. Wow. Scared me. Alright. Hello. We've landed in the Founders. Yeah. I think it says Founders Road. Here it is. It's kind of cool. It's like different designs etched. They almost look like thrones. These are some old style tombs, you know? Oh! Hello! You came out of nowhere! There we go. There we go. Oh, you bit me. Oh, why'd they have to make that sound though? Hmm. Well, shouldn't have come at me. Um, hmm, let me see here. Let's climb down the other side. The other side looks like it just envelops an area that doesn't progress us, possibly. Yeah, see? Let's go down here first. Ugh. The grate seems to be firmly attached. Alright then. Yes, nothing. Check, check on my flashlight. <laughs> Uh, all right. Let's move forward. Oh, hello. Fancy seeing you all here. I don't think I can crouch, so I can just duck. Yeah. Ray is firmly attached. I think we climb up. <coughs> Perfect. And. Oh man, we're clear in this place. Uh, I didn't check that door though. Or maybe I did. I'm uh, sorry if I did. Sometimes the game bugs and doesn't show a door when I already <coughs> searched it. I remember from the last episode that happened. Oh yeah, see it's just... Okay, see. There we go. Now we get a line. Alright, let's go. Let's drop! Boom, 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 boom! Yeah! Okay, we're here. Uh, I'm gonna go around the perimeter first before I go in the middle. Not because I'm scared or anything. These are all gonna be locked. A lot of tombstones here. Looks like a family grave site. Y'all hear that? Oh! Yeah! I knew it! I don't think we need the flashlight right now. Oh, hello. Y'all ready for this? Let's get in here. Closer, closer, closer. Oh, ooh, ooh, we countered me. Phew. What were you eating on? Oh, it was a person. Gross. Hey, that looks like the shepherd's... Glen logo. Oh, this is the Holloway family mausoleum. Mausoleum. My god, why is that word so hard for me? They are one of the four founding families. Okay. And this one? The Fitch family mausoleum. The lock to the door looks like the one from Dad's hunting room. I wonder how I'm supposed to open it. Hmm. Let's go to the front. Here. Padlocked and overgrown. Alright, then we just go north. Up there. Hey, where'd the body go? That's not suspicious at all. Oi. Hello? 
once whole but now split in twain, opens the way for souls to lead, find the plates and release their pain, once separate but now whole again. Look at this place. Super creepy. Aha! Here it is! Oh, I can't use it here? Do we, we must put it somewhere else then. This fountain is hereby dedicated to the memory of Claire Borden by her loving parents. The other one was Charlotte, I think. Not sure. Tragically lost moments after her twin sister died. Born. The rest is illegible. Age 8. Inseparable yet divided, two halves of the same person in two places now forever apart. Can we put it together in our inventory? No. Okay. We will probably use it. Maybe there. Let's check out this whole area first. There was another section back there I kind of missed. Names are worn away. Okay, this way. The guardian that once was whole reveals the way that is shut. Two halves on twins enshrined, forever split in waters divine. Okay, that was that was all I wanted to see. Um. Yeah, yeah. We're good. Let's go forward. This must be it. It. Looks like an emblem. Yeah. There we go. Anything in these nook and crannies for me? Ah, the parking lot. Wow, we cleared that pretty fast. Alright, parking lot, huh? Let's see. It's back here. It smells like something died in this dumpster. Someone needs to empty these dumpsters. Why hasn't this been towed away? It's obviously broken down. I hear the wind. We're close to an edge. What the hell happened to the streets? Better. How's it going? Evening? I think this is a point of interest, but... A comic book store opened here right before I left. It looks closed now. I guess there wasn't enough demand for juvenile stuff like comics. I bet Josh was sad it closed. He loved comic books. Aww. I like when they give me little bits of story like that. It's covered in dust and ash. This van hasn't gone anywhere in a long time. The reason I love that so much when when not only just say like about the object, like it's been here for a long time, it's dusty or whatever. The reason I like getting bits of the character's background or life or family or friends or mental states, um, it's just because it gives insight into just exactly what I said, their mental state. And it's cool to hear parts of their family and their friends or their perceptions of reality. It's just really, really nice. Another abandoned shop. Is there anything around here still open? Not only that, but I think it re um, rewards the player, right? For, for exploring things. What did that say? Why hasn't this van been towed? It's blocking the entire alleyway. Got her? watching you. There's a lot of gutters. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Yeah, let's check these benches. Check things for items. It's a squat car like my dad used to drive. Oh, his dad was a cop. His dad was a cop. It all makes sense. Not saying all cops are aggressive, but I was about to say that's why he's so aggressive. But I know a cop that's not aggressive, so... It's not exactly always true. Okay. Oh! There is a person right there. In the middle of... 
Ah, oh, we cut around here. Okay, wait, before we... Hold on. I want to look at everything. This flag has not been taken down for a long time. Oh, I didn't even know the... I didn't even know there was a flag flying up there. America! Yeah, they need a new flag. Come on. Y'all don't have the city funds? Oh! <laughs> Shepherds Glen Police! Interesting. Interesting. We're gonna learn more. We're gonna learn more about his dad. That's gonna be fun. Uh-uh. Alright. Alright. It's dead. What the heck? This is just here and she's like 20 feet away. It appears I'm not the only one that doesn't like these dogs. Ouch. <laughs> Jeez, what's going on? And she's gonna act like she doesn't see anything. Watch. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh. Hey. Missing persons? Ouch. Damn it! Falling on you your knee like that? that? You okay? Oh, he knows her. Alex? Oh my god, Alex! Aww. She's so pretty. Hey, uh, your mom told me I might see you around here. Oh god, my god, it's that's so L. Good to see you. It feels like it's been forever. Wow, they could be sisters. You alone out here? Well, hey, you know, I didn't think I'd ever see you again. We took off without saying goodbye. Yeah, well, I'm not here for long. I'm looking for my brother. You seen him? No. I haven't, Alex. I'm sorry. Jesus, what the hell is going on here? I don't know. Every day there are more flyers to put up. Every day more people disappear. I had no idea. And if you did? Would you have done anything about it? Yeah, I would have come back for Josh. Gotten him the hell out of here. God knows what kind of trouble he's in now. Trouble? Look around you, Alex. This whole place is in trouble. She knows. She's aware. I get it. But I have to find my brother. He's my responsibility. After that, I'm gone. I suggest you do the same. Hmm. Okay. Alex, wait. Yeah. I got this from Deputy Wheeler. You should take it. Wheeler. What for? If I hear anything, I'll let you know. Thanks, Al. Alex. I hope you find what you're looking for. My brother? I hope so too. Okay, so he's got a plan. It's like, once I find my brother, I am freaking gone. You will not catch me here. Interesting. So that was kind of cool. I like that interaction between them two. Um, a lot more personality. Alex, I can't talk right now. A lot more per- she has a lot more uh, personality than her mom, but I think her mom is just, you know, get out of my face, I'm working. <laughs> I mean, she is too, but... Well, that was cool. So, she's putting up all these missing posters. Uh, but I wonder what her responsibility Alex, is. I don't know anything else. Please, just let me do my work. Is she also in law? I would imagine. Park the truck here. Shepherd's Gint. Glen Police! We didn't get to see Dad much since he spent so much time here. Hmm. Also, the music during the cutscene was awesome. I uh, I hope I don't have to cut out too much of that. Um, I might have to. Bartlett Vineyards Estate Winery. This winery is owned by the Bartlett family. My parents would go to dinner there occasionally. My brother and I were never allowed to come along. Hmm. A nice Silent Hill party or something? Okay, let's go ahead and go inside. 
Oh, I wish I could search a trunk or something. That would make me happy. Oh, there's more. Holy moly. What's this say? Black Forest? Black Forest Bridge, maybe? Over this river. Cool. <gasps> you know what I just realized? We need to find a weapon still. Um, that will open up all the boards. And look at this. We're gonna go here later for sure. Oh, for some reason I thought it was locked! It's open! The world is opening up for us, everybody. Toilet. Looks like Curtis has stripped the usable parts from these. Curtis, huh? This is a big generator. I wonder where he got it from. So, Alex also knows this guy. It's too much junk. I can't get through. Oh. Trucking a lot of junk. This blocking my way. Oh, it like hijacked my camera to let me know. Curtis must not be expecting guests. There must be another way around. I see, I see. Yeah, there's a hole. And it's not gone. <laughs> it's here. God, that stinks. I don't even want to know what's inside. Oh man, I remember this. Kids at school would dare each other to climb to the top and jump off. I wonder how many legs have been broken here. Jeez, off the top? How crazy. Mm -mm. I can't tell if he was fixing this or tearing it apart. Looks like we might go in there. That's a big winch. <laughs> wow, this stinks. I think it's filled with mirror. Is that paint or blood on the table? That looks like blood. Squeeze through. Where are we? We're off the map. We've gone off. Ooh, the ambient track changed. There's too much junk. I can't get through. Okay, so we're back now at the front where we're supposed to be. Or where the front is, so... I imagine this is where we're supposed to be. Another person! Oh! Hello. Hello. Can I ask you something? Oh, why do you say I'm it like busy. that? <laughs> okay, well... I feel vindicated in the way Alex said hello because he was like, I'm busy. How's hey, it man. going? How's it going? <laughs> you're Curtis? Hey, you're Curtis, right? <laughs> Uh-oh. Probably copyright music. La 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 la. I might have to mute it. I don't know. <laughs> I know you. Sheriff's kid. Alex. Military man now, I see. I'm pretty sure it's broken. What do you think? That's right. I think you must have stole this from your daddy. None your business. Just tell me if you can fix it. Don't go barking orders at me, soldier. The only person that tells me what to do is me. Got it? Just wanted to see if you could fix it. It's a damn shame the way people mistreat such nice things. Look, what I really need is some information. Have you seen my brother Joshua? You want to talk to the mayor? He knows everybody's business. Mayor, mayor Bartlett. Bartlett. Oh, <laughs> Jinx. You know where I can find him? Same place he is every day. Oh. Digging up people's graves. You know, there's something seriously wrong with that guy. That's Mayor Bartlett? Yep. No wonder all the streets are broken. Nobody around here gives a shit anymore. I could fix it. Might take a little while, though. Keep it. It's yours. What's the catch? Consider it payment for your help. Soldiers gotta have a gun. Ooh, fair freaking way more than fair exchange. Jeez. Thanks. Yeah, thanks. Holy crap. Yeah. I like a fair trade. <laughs> it's funny he said that. 
I was thinking, more than fair, he's got to do work to fix that gun, but it's going to be a beast when he gets it working if he can, and he says he can. But look at me. I've got a functional working gun now. You probably enter shift. Oh, yeah, okay. Don't aim at your peeps. Don't aim towards people. Gun safety. Damn, wish I had some change. Those snacks look good. Yeah, they do. Okay. That was a weird interaction. I feel like Alex got a feel for that guy better than I did. Hey, man. One more question. Because he, wa he wanted to kind of get on his good side, you know? Can I have the shotgun? Why are you still here? How about I take that shotgun off your hands? <laughs> yeah? How about if I slap you and kill you, huh? You looking for a weapon? Take a look around the place. I'm sure you'll find something else you could use. Yes, sir. <laughs> you got a lot of clock parts in this place. Is there a reason? Yeah, there's a reason. For fixing clocks! Haven't you noticed that every single clock in this town has stopped at exactly 206? Mm. No, I hadn't. But then take a look around, son. <laughs> Have you ever tried fixing them? Kid. I can fix just about anything you put in front of me, but I've never seen anything like this. There's no reason they're not working. It's like there's something causing it. We did see that what? at our mom's. Well, that's what you're trying to figure now, isn't it? I'm just trying to find my brother. Now, you might want to think about opening your eyes to everything else that's going on around here. You might find it'll lead you to where you want to go. All right, thanks for the info. More random junk. The sandwich looks old. Is Curtis really eating that? Steak! Nice. Just take it right by this guy. Ew, the sandwich does look old. One in the back. Oh my gosh, there's more back here. Look at all this. This place is littered with items. Junkyard map. Oh my gosh, it's a whole place. Okay. Health drink. Oh, yes. Save point. I wonder if I only have those five slots. I would suck if I did. But, you know, it is what it is. Oh, wait, 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 go back. There was some soul ammunition back there. I, I, I haven't come across an enemy yet, and maybe we will. Uh, that is difficult to handle, so I might just keep using the knife, to be honest. Save the pistol for something at range, or perhaps something that moves really fast and flies. Why would he save any of this? And who would ever buy it? Alright y'all, let's figure out what we're doing. I, I, I thought I was going into the uh, police station and then I guess I just missed the door. You know, completely. It was probably locked now that I'm here, but I just got a little sidetracked. Let me use my flashlight. Nothing in the fridge. Okay. And I don't think we can go in here. No. Okay, so it looks like we can just go back. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh oh. There's something on the other side. Uh huh. <coughs> There we go, there we go. Sunlock? No, I was trying. Hmm. Is that a sound? Okay. Now I'm gonna go check the police station. Um, he did say, look around. I'm sure you'll find something you can use, like a weapon or something. So I kind of wonder if I should have been able to find something like an axe to so tap down those boards. But, um, 
I'm not gonna beat it to death. You know, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna move forward. We get a little cutscene. New owner. Hello? Alex Shepard. Hello? Hello? What's going on? Oh my god, is that Midwich? That's what it sounds like to me. Look at this! Alright, lovely. That's what's emitting all the smoke. Ouch! He's doing some kind of... Oh my gosh, let's dodge. It's kind of hard to dodge when you're locked in. There we go. Man, he's tonky! Goodness. Is it dead? <gasps> really interesting design. I like the light parts of its body. It's like bulbous and glowing. The gate to the sheriff's parking lot seems to be locked. Okay. I'm gonna go back up to the front though and look around some more. This is gonna turn us around. Yep. Very neat touch. Okay. Well, I feel affirmed. Or reaffirmed. I'm going the right way. I saw something back here. Oh my god, that does not look good. Front. I guess I didn't check. This is the station where Dad works. I wonder if his buddies on the course know what happened to. It looks like nobody's here. Where are the police? What the hell is happening? Okay, so we can't go in. Okay. And the parking lot gate is closed as well. Hmm. Did we go up Riverview? Well, I guess we go back to the cemetery. I don't know why I took that hit. Come on! Whew. The only reason I think we might go back is because the dogs are populated here. Oh, look at that! Get him while he's while his back is turned. You know what? The knife is it's fine. Can you like <laughs> not tea back? <laughs> I was wondering if you could stomp on him or something. All right, what do we have? Nothing. We have literally nothing. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Whew. No problem. Yeah, let's check this out now. Maybe it's open? Nope, firmly attached. Alright. Hmm. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Not good. Ooh, not a very good corridor to attack. Alright, let's try to dodge behind him. It can. Oh, I tried. Cute. He is messing me up in this narrow corridor. Alright, come on. You can do it, Alex. Stun lock him. That's right. Alright, back to what I was doing. Trying to make our way back to where the mayor was. Yeah, 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 through here, through here. Oh, thanks for sticking it out, y'all. We are making our way. So he's supposed to be here. So we just go straight ahead. Oh! Here we go! He's supposed to be here! But he's not. Of course he'd be gone now. What a creepy looking statue. It is creepy. But very cool at the same time. Alright, he's gotta be in here, right? Let's see. Ooh. Nope. It's just me. In this crypt. Looks like a child's coffin. There's some sort of strange lock keeping it closed. Whoa. Okay. But this must release it. This piece needs to be pulled free. Alright, so maybe these need to be facing... They need to rotate? Oh, I click and drag. Oh! Interesting. Alright, now how do I rotate it? Unless maybe... Well, you can move those too. Oh, I guess there's no rhyme or reason to it. You just need to be able to get this all the way down. I see. There we go. I love the etching and symbols, the glyphs on those stones. What in the world are we doing? Hello? A watch. A time reference. Locked in a crypt. Hmm. Forgive me. Oh, forgive me. Hmm. Are we going? He is out cold. All right, we have awoken somewhere new.
That's Anne's, the hair place. We're back on the other side, I think. Wait, wait, no, I'm wrong completely. We're in Silent Hill! Woo! So exciting. Get all in, Alex. <gasps> Josh. Hey. Josh. Run. Run after the boy. Oh my gosh. All right. We got to find a save point. That. It's been a long episode already. Doesn't look like they're open anymore. Checking it all. Anyway, I thought that sign said it. Well, it says Anne Black, but I thought it was that Anne's hair place. S and W Bank. Bank is close to. I can hear another track. It's copyright. I gotta talk over it or edit it out. <laughs> la 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 la. <laughs> Oh, I can hear my radio. Uh-uh. I don't want to be locked in that narrow hallway. Grand Hotel. Hey. Hey! There he is. Why would Joshua be hiding in a hotel? I need to make sure he's okay. I'll need something to break down these boards. Agreed. I hear something. Something squelchy. Oh yeah, there you are. Let's try our gun before the end of the episode. Why not? It's alright. I assume you hit it in the chest. Yeah, it's okay. It's alright. I just like the idea of the knife. And yeah, this broken watch, that was kind of cool. There was, it was literally nothing except the watch locked in that tome. I don't think there was any meaning behind the puzzle, but it was kind of interesting, the symbolism. I see a body over there. Must be another way around. Oh! Over here! <coughs> yeah! Yeah! Here we go. Oh, we go under it. <gasps> An axe! I've seen so many people in this, but have seen better days. Okay. Feeling vindicated. Feeling great. Let's go put this axe to use. Boom. Oh yeah. I'm coming for you, Josh. I got this. Very cool. Maybe we'll try out the axe in combat, but... I'm loving the knife, man. It's it does exactly what it's supposed to. <gasps> Hello? Josh? Hoey. Josh, wait. Yeah, get back here. You little sneaker! Ah. Where are you going? Gosh, the ambience. It's so creepy. Grand Hotel Reception Desk. Alright, let me backtrack to where I started. Awesome, we got the map! Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. Paul, as Mayor Bartlett will be working in the atrium late this evening, please make sure the exterior service doors are left unlocked. Mr. Jones. Oh, it's so creepy. I'm sure all these will be locked or 
broken or jammed. Hello? I see something on the wall. Oh, baby. Oof. Really cool ambience and atmosphere in here. It gives me like this ghost ship vibe. I mean, it is like really messed up in here. I am intrigued, excited. <gasps> Watch it, Alex. Don't be knocking over the faces. All right, we well, maybe we go through here. Dang it! All right, we jump down then, I guess. Oh, a cross. <coughs> like we went down for some reason. Hello? It's a box of tools. It's... It looks pretty unorganized. Ooh. Maintenance key! Perfect. I haven't seen a door that said maintenance yet, but... It's surely this one? Oh, it's jammed shut. <gasps> Sheesh. Maintenance, huh? Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. Cause I'd already I'd already searched that way. Alright, how do we reload? R As suspected, R was it. So I just started blasting. <laughs> I do not like these things at all. All right, let's finish him with the knife. Ooh. Ooh, brutal. Okay. Hmm. Let's check back here for the maintenance door. Nope. Hmm. Well, every every door was was jammed or locked or broken. Maybe we go through here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. Got it! Okay, perfect. It's coming to corner me though. Health drink. What else? What else? We need to rewire this. Oh, is it moving real time? It is. I'm out of here, dude. I'm I'm out of here. These things are brutal. Alright, we got this. We got this. I wanna use my gun for this one. This thing is dangerous. How did that hurt me? Goodness. Okay. Let's get this thing uh wired right. Um I guess this one is the only one missing. Okay. On? Oh, test power. There we go. Ah, it's gotta be the right... I guess... position? From the top to the bottom? I guess. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out how to do it. Oh, there we go. Oh. You highlight the one you want, and then you... Okay, there you go. Okay, I see. I'm gonna guess it goes like this. Oh no. Hmm. Okay, I guess it's just trial and error. Okay, we got three right. Does that mean the first three are right? Alright, let me try this. Let's try that. Okay, okay. Yep, so this one was correct. Here. 
and maybe these two. What about now? No, I did worse. Now I messed up my work. Now I need to look back at my recording to see. Hmm. So I've tried a couple different combos, and I get the green light on the first one. Um, even though I switched the positions of the first and the second, so now I'm kind of wondering how is it determining what's correct? Alright. <sighs> Bro, come on. Alright, uh, then we switch these two. Mm -mm. Nope, that was not it at all. This was the, the, the best that I've done. So, if we switch... Let's try. Let's just try something crazy. Oh yeah, no, never mind. Go back. Go back. Go now. Yes. Ah! Sorry, I clapped in the. <laughs> so sorry for the clap. I know that was probably super loud to any headphone users. Okay, I was just excited. I finally got it. It was just trial and error, really. We got the power back on. Or the power on. Yep. Lovely. Looks beautiful in here. Love it already. So, I can see this... ...was shining brightly. Ooh. Oh my god. Where are we headed? Pistol ammunition. Sweet! I... Needed that. Load it up. Load it up. I don't have much of a choice. Only one of the buttons seems to be functional. Then we go into the fifth blow! Where to? <gasps> My flashlight! Uh oh. New enemy. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh. Yep. That was terrifying. Did I just hit him with the gun? That was incredible. Come on. Come at me. Where? I got you. Come on. Oh, I can't really get him through here very much. Oh, maybe now I can? Alright, alright. Let's not mess around. Let's not mess around. Oh, the music though. Let's get out of here, can we? No, we can't. We just gotta fight. All we got, so guess what? I'm locked in. I'm doing the axe. I'm trying. Take that. Youch. Oh, thank God we're moving. Oh, oh shoot. Up. Oh, I see it. Sorry, I forgot I was in combat stance. Whew. What angelic singing! In such a dark place to hear something so beautiful. Such a crazy contrast. I think there's something behind this painting. This weapon won't help me cut the use. We need our knife. 
Oh, cool. Nice. I want to check all the doors, though, first. I checked that one already. The music is awesome. Joey Bartlett. Joey Bartlett sitting in the treehouse in our backyard. Yeah, so when he said Shepherd in the graveyard or the cemetery, I was like, that must be the reveal. That his family, Alex's family, is one of the founders. And if it's named Shepherd Glenn, Shepherd's Glenn, then he must be high up there on the totem pole. Okay, well, we've reached a save point. This has been a long episode, but I hope that y'all still enjoyed it. And I'm loving this so far. I'm intrigued to see what we're going to find in this hotel. And whose lovely voice that is that we hear. Who's the siren? Alright y'all, can't wait to pick it back up. Thank y'all so much for watching, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Ciao!